Hello everybody and welcome to Mr. Gamer Guide's 123's newest series. This is Black Cobra with Antoine Gonzalez. And why don't you take us to this amazing new series that you thought of? Well, I thought I thought about it. And in ten seconds I came up with, with, with the most amazing name. You, you, you wanna hear it? Yeah. It's called the 2013 season of NFL Quick Fix. Ooh. I know. It's by far the greatest thing I've ever heard in my life. It's just amazing. It's so, so original. So we're going to start off with tonight's game at 8.30 p.m. on NBC. You know, Baltimore Ravens. <laughs> the Baltimore Ravens versus the Denver Broncos. Now... Antoine, what do you think of this match? Well, this is a rematch from the playoffs last year when Baltimore won it. Or no, they forced overtime in the final like in, in the final minutes, and then they won it, and they went on the Super Bowl. And they won. That is amazing. So, I think, plain and simple, the Denver the Denver Broncos are going to beat them. They're going to get their revenge. Ooh, that, that, that sounds like a very good pick. Now, I'm going to have to agree with you on the Denver Broncos, mostly because I have a Yahoo team, I have a Yahoo fantasy sports team, and I'm hoping Peyton Manning does great tonight, because I need them points. And I'm going to go with the Denver Broncos tonight. And just so you know, guys, even though this video might not be uploaded on Thursday, we are recording this before the game tonight. It's 3.41 right now. Yeah. So, yeah. the game doesn't start for another five hours, just so you know. Yeah. Now on to Sunday's games, the many Sunday games. The first one, the New England Patriots versus the Buffalo Bills. Oh, this should be a good match. And we have it's them. tough for me to do this, but I'm going to have to go with the New England Patriots. Oh my gosh, I can't I have to go against, this on live internet. I have to go against my own Buffalo Bills, but really, I think the Bills are going to get destroyed in this game. It's going to be pretty embarrassing, even though it's at home. With Jeff Tool. Well, EJ, they, actually, they were saying that that's an EJ Manuel. <gasps> but you know what? I'm going to go with another bold prediction. <laughs> if the Bills win this game, they're going to the playoffs. I said it. Yeah. I said it. Yeah. No. I might, I might, <laughs> I might go 0 for 2. The Bills might win this game, and then they don't make the playoffs, but I might go 2 for 2. Actually, no, I can't, I can't, no. I, I could go two for two because if the Patriots win and the Bills don't make the playoffs, I get it. Okay. Yeah. So, so, yeah. I'm going with the Patriots. I, I'm going to go with the good old Buffalo Pride. I'm going to go with the Buffalo Bills. Even though every Buffalo citizen in this town has lost faith in their in their own team. Yes. I haven't. Well, I know you haven't, but mostly everyone has. Think, think of the future. No. The future. No. Alright, so let's move on to the next team. Uh, let's move on to the next timing at 1 p.m. There's also the Seattle Seahawks versus the Carolina Panthers. So who do you think is going to win? Well, I have my own fantasy team, but in my in in this thing, it's between me and my family, and we choose teams randomly. And these two teams I both have, so... I'm guaranteed to win. I'm guaranteed to loss also. So, mm -hmm. but going on to the game, I think I'm gonna go with the Seahawks. Mm. I think the Carolina Panthers are gonna win. Oh, I don't. I really don't know much more about the Seahawks or the Panthers. All I know is that they have Cam Newton, and even though I did say Cam Newton sucks balls, I'm just gonna go ahead and say with Cam Newton, and I'm gonna go with Carolina Panthers. So let's go with the next 1 p.m. game, which basically, wait, yeah, basically all of them are at 1 p.m. Almost. Yeah, basically. So we're going to go with the next matchup between Cincinnati Bengals and the Chicago Bears, right? Yep. Yeah. Um, um, I'll go, you can go first. I'll, I'll go this first one. this one. Um, I'm going to go with the Cincinnati Bengals. I'm only basing this off of gas because of that amazing play that one right receiver had. Oh my God. He did the front flip over the defender, and it was just pure amazingness. Yes. yes. So, what do you think? I'm going to have to agree with you on the Bengals. I think, I think the Bengals are going to surprise. Well, 
a lot of people are thinking that the Bengals are going to make the playoffs again this year. Uh-huh. And I have to think so, too. I think the Bengals are going to make the playoffs this year. And oh, they're really? going to they're gonna do... They're going to hopefully get one game further than they did last year when they lost against mm-hmm. the Texans. Yeah, really? It's a sad day. But yeah, so we're both going to go with the Bengals there. Yeah. The next game, the Miami Dolphins versus the Cleveland Browns. So why didn't you enlighten us on who's good and who's bad? In this matchup, I don't think either of them are going to make the playoffs. Mm. But I'm going to go with the Miami Dolphins. I'm going to go over the Cleveland Dolphins. I'm going to go with the Dolphins too. Just because I like Dolphins. Yeah. Ooh! I don't want to do this one. Next is the Minnesota Vikings versus the Detroit Tigers. No, Detroit Lions. My bad. My bad. Detroit Lions. Now, in my opinion, I think definitely think the Detroit Lions are going to win this. Calvin Johnson, Megatron is going to utterly annihilate this case. What do you think? I think this will be one of the upsets of the of, of week one. I think the Vikings are going to upset the Lions. Go out on the limb on that. Go for the best. All right. Next are the Oakland Raiders versus the Indianapolis Colts. And in my in in my fantasy league, I am the proud owner of having the the power ranked 32 dead last in the league, Oakland Raiders. <laughs> well, who do you think? Will? I think the Raiders are going to lose. <laughs> <laughs> I think Andrew Luck and the Colts are going to come up on top. Against the, again, 32 power ranks. Um, dead last of the Raiders. I'm going to have to agree with you on that. So, uh, the next is the Kansas City Chiefs. Chiefs. Yeah, Kansas City Chiefs versus the Jacksonville Jaguars. Ooh, what do you think? I also have the Chiefs. I think. I think the I'm going to go ahead and choose the Chiefs over the Jaguars. I think Alex Smith is going to mm-hmm. make mm-hmm. somewhat uh, somewhat of an, of an impact on the Chiefs' first game. I know nothing of these teams. Then yeah. you can take a wild guess. So I'm going to pick... Just like you did with some of the ones. I'm going to go ahead and pick off the mascots. Now a, jag- a Jaguar can eat a Chief. So I'm going to go with Jaguar. Yeah. The next one. The Atlanta Falcons against the New Orleans New Orleans Saints. Yeah. You can go first. I don't know anybody from these teams. Let's do it. Here, wait. You talk, and I'm going to check out the players. All right. Um, ooh, this one's top. Uh... I think I'm gonna go with the. I'm going with my gut here. I'm gonna go with the Atlanta Falcons. Mm-hmm. They went 0-4 in the preseason, but I think they're gonna get their first their first win here in in in, uh, in week one. All right, give me one more minute. All right, I can't find anyone here. I'm gonna go with the Saints. Go with the Saints. Yeah. Right. The next game, the Tampa Bay Buccaneers versus the New York Struggling Jets. Mm. Many, many issues. And once again, I'm the proud owner of both of these teams, Amy. But I'm gonna go with the Buccaneers over the Jets. I think the Jets need to all need to talk to some to some people that can help them with their with their issues. You know, like a psychiatrist. The Jets, the Jets need. Yeah. They have many issues. I don't feel comfortable talking about them. <laughs> I'm gonna go with the. I'm gonna go with the psychotic Jets. Okay. Yeah, because I'm psychic. The last 1 p.m. game is the Tennessee Titans versus the 
Pittsburgh Steelers. I'm gonna go with Steelers. I'm only they didn't going make the playoffs because last year. I'm only going with Pittsburgh because they got Ben Roethlisberger, and I like his last name, Burger. Now we go on to some of the 4 p.m. games: the Green Bay Packers versus the San Francisco 49ers. Oh, the 49ers! All the way, Kaepernick. And I think the Packers, just like the Broncos, are going to get their revenge on the Broncos on, on the on the Ravens. I think the Packers are going to get their revenge against the 49ers. Never! The 49ers shall rule all! So now... Oh my gosh, here we go. Arizona the Cardinals, Cardinals versus, versus the St. Louis Rams. Rams. And I think the Rams are going to show the Cardinals what the are made out of. Yes. I have the St. Louis Rams. But I think Sam, Sam Bradford is going to I think is gonna stand out for the Rams. I think they, these Rams... We're gonna crush the Cardinals. I hope they do. Yes. And now, Sunday Night Football, the New York Giants versus the Dallas Stars. That's you, I man. You're just like, who? Tony Homo. Tony Homo! Yes, Tony Homo. And I think I'm gonna go. This, this is the one pick that I'm gonna make that I'm not sure about. I'm gonna go with the Dallas Cowboys. Oh, you're going with Tony Homo. <laughs> no yeah. reason. But I am simply go going with the Giants because the Giants. Yeah. Only because if my start quarterback, he's now on the team, but his brother is. So I'm going to use his brother. Go Eli! And now the two Monday night football games. The... Philadelphia Eagles versus the Washington Redskins. Ooh. And I'm gonna go with the Washington Redskins. I think it's going to be a high scoring game. Mm -hmm. But I think the Eagles defense is going to be dead just horrible. Yes. Atrocious against yes. Washington. Yes. RG three is gonna get like seven touchdowns. Yeah. Uh, no. I'm not that, that that wasn't that wasn't a, a, a I guess no, no. but I, I do think it's gonna be a high scoring game yes. and the Redskins are gonna come out on top. Yes. And I think the Washington Redskins will utterly dominate the game with RG three. Alright. Because RG three was mad that everyone accuses him of him purposely hurting his knee for when it was the, the the center the center the center's fault. So RG3 is coming back with a burning passion and a fire lit up on his ass, and he's gonna win. They're gonna go to the playoffs. Let's go with that. Yeah. <laughs> and now the last game of Week One in the 2013 NFL season, the Houston Texans will take on the San Diego Chargers, and I'm going with the Texans. I too. Unlike the other game, I think this will be a low-scoring game. Mm -hmm. I'm going that. Mm -hmm. I am going with the Texans because their defense needs to be spot on. Because they're in my fantasy league and they need to be like freaking amazing, or else someone's getting dropped. All right, so that is it for week one of this new series called. NFL quick picks of the for the 2013 NFL season. We'll try to keep. Well, ho hopefully, we'll, we'll keep up every week. We'll make a video every week, and at the end, we can see who gets the most wins, who gets the most losses, and who wins the, the, the trophy. The trophy. This is. Okay. Oh. Well, there, there, there's well, a trophy. Well, no one, no one for <laughs> me of said trophy. Okay, the winner gets a cookie. Yay, cookie! I enjoy cookies. But yeah, um, we'll, we'll try to keep up dates <laughs> every week and we'll mm -hmm. keep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't know where yeah. I was going with that. So place, but that's this it. is Mr. Gamer Guides. This is Black Cobra signing off with. Antoine Gonzalez, who's also signing off. Yeah.